Hey Scorpios and welcome to my channel. I'm here doing your weekend love, or your weekend love, I'm sorry, your weekly love reading from the 16th to the 22nd. So I'm going to tip you on down here and we'll get started right away. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, Scorpio signs. Um, this will not resonate with everybody, uh, so take what you want, leave what you don't. And let's get started. Spirit and Angels, what message do you have for Scorpios this week in love? First row will be you, Scorpio. Second row is who you're connecting with. Third row is the outcome. All right, here we go. First card out, the Empress. Um, something's not uh, coming through. Something isn't. Um, something isn't getting off the ground here. Could be dealing with an air sign, um, but communication's being blocked. And the outcome. Wow. Your situation. Okay. Scorpios. You're all in reverse here. The only two cards in the upright. Oops. Are the Queen of Swords in your row and the Five of Swords in their row. So that is literally the only card, including the uh, situation and clarifier. So you're waiting for your blessings to come in. You're waiting for your gifts, your ships. Um, but they're not going to come in until you decide to let this energy go and to move on um, towards what is meant for you. You're not getting your blessings right now because you're stuck. You are refusing to let go of a relationship you're currently in. And uh, Scorpios, you need to set out on that spiritual journey. Why is the Empress here in reverse for Scorpios this week? And the queen. And the eight. And the three of pentacles. The five of swords. The knight of swords. Three of cups. The four of pentacles. Okay. So every single... um card as your clarifiers are in reverse too, except for two. So on the bottom of the deck is the five of cups. You are mourning the loss of, uh, of somebody who, who you thought, um, was going to be in your life forever. So this person that you, um, are not getting off the ground with could be an air sign male, uh, Libra, especially, but Scorpios, this person has been very cold to you. Very, they cut you off. Um, you have been very jaded as well with the King of Swords. Um, you're kind of stuck in your memories of the past. And by being stuck, you're not allowing your blessings to come through. That's the second time you have the Two of Wands here in reverse. Or Three of Wands, I'm sorry. So um, you need to let go of this negative energy that you're harboring, that you're holding on to um, from the past because you can't move forward from it. Um, somebody cut off communication, whether it be you or the other person, uh, because you're so confused. You're living in a haze. You're in a cloud of confusion. You don't know what is right from wrong. You don't know what is the truth. What isn't. Um, I'm getting that this person, uh, possibly betrayed you. You have the three of pentacles in reverse in their, uh, row followed by the page of cups. So they may have offered their love to the other person. If you're in a third party situation, um, or they were offered a job and left, um, where you were to take that job, but I'm focusing on love. So if this is in love, they offered their um, love to somebody else that was in this third party. They decided to walk away from the situation with you because there was a lot of conflict, a lot of battling. They chose to be single um, in order to try to figure out what it was that they wanted as well. They weren't offering any truth. However, they were lying to you. Um, yeah, they have the five of swords here twice too. So they just uh, decided it was going to be easier to walk away than to stick around and like to tell you the truth. That's why you're left in such a haze of confusion. Um, they just up and left. Yeah, not offering you any explanation or anything, but it's, it's being called that you were not meant to be with this person, Scorpio. You are meant to be moving forward in your own spiritual journey. In the outcome, the third party is ending. 
because they made a choice. Um, however, Scorpio, I don't feel that they chose you. Um, but uh, you guys are holding on to your emotions, the both of you. You are very, um, you're coming out of a time, though, however, um, of allowing this energy to go. They, uh, they offered their energy to somebody else. They are dealing with karma, however, and in the reverse, they are not dealing with good karma. So um, they will get the karma that they deserve for um, leaving you with nothing but lies, uh, deceiving you. Uh, the King of Wands is here in the reverse. Could be an Aries male um, that, that they were involved with. Um, yeah, but Scorpio, I do see you finding love in the near future. Let me see if I can get another card. When will, when will Scorpios find love? Yeah, be patient, Scorpios. You have a fire sign that's coming very in very quickly. Um, so be patient. You do have love coming, coming in. Um, keep working on yourselves. Let this energy go that deceived you. Um, you're just you're holding on to a lot of negativity. Wow. And the eight of wands on your bottom. Okay, so the knight of wands is coming in with the king of um, wands. This person, oops, that king of wands was in reverse, which was right here as well, reverse. This person's going to exit your life very quickly. Could be an Aries, but whoever it is, they are out of their element. They are not acting in line with who they should be. But be patient because you have the king of cups coming. Be patient. Do the work on yourself because you have love coming. And this is the most beautiful love that is that is meant for you. So have the courage to walk out on your own spiritual journey um, and allow your blessings to come in. And you're going to be just fine, Scorpios. This is going to be a rough week of energy for you, um, for this group of you. However, um, the card that came out, you deserve love. You are lovable. Don't don't put up with this um, this energy that you have in your space right now that leaves you with um, confusion and lies. The Horse King is your advice card, assistance, and control. So ask your angels for help. Ask your angels for assistance in moving out of this energy. And it's time to gain control of your life, your emotions, your actions, because right now. You guys are acting out in haste. You could be acting out of fear. Um, but just uh, just know that this this relationship, um, it was it was not meant for you. What you're being called to do is to move forward, to move on on a spiritual journey and um, find that two of cups that you guys deserve because you do deserve love. So, um, yeah, this message is kind of uh heavy this week, Scorpios, but keep your head up. Keep the faith. You guys have many blessings coming in. As always, I wish you love, light, and God bless.